tell y'all this. Don't think that you need makeup to look like that girl because you already that girl. That girl is something that's within. <laughs> Real J Wills. If you didn't know, now you know. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're returning, honey, what's a goodie in a hoodie, y'all? So as you guys can tell by the title, today's video is going to be a tutorial on this bomb face of mine. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. I'm gonna be giving you guys a tutorial on how I beat my face. How I got my makeup like this, really easy, really simple. I tend to do the same thing when it comes to my makeup. And I get a lot of questions on how I do my makeup, a tutorial. So I decided to give it to you guys and I hope you guys enjoy it. So yeah, without further ado, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let's get into the video. Also, you guys, I, I am going to be like the mirror is right here in front of me. At first, I am starting with my eyebrow pencil. This eyebrow pencil is by, and I've done a makeup tutorial on my channel. Let me just let y'all know that I have done a makeup tutorial on my channel, but um, it's a lot older and I I think I do my makeup pretty fine and I'm not a makeup artist at all, by far at all. So I'm going to show y'all what I do to kind of do like a little light makeup, a light beat. So yeah, right now I'm doing my eyebrows. And there's no, y'all, me, I t I'm telling you, I'm not a um, makeup artist or anything. So, my techniques are very, like, at home. Just fill those bad boys in like that. Mm. Okay, it's, 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 it's not giving snatched right now, but we're going to get it together. So, let me do the other side and I'll be back. So yeah, this one is really hitting a lot harder than this one. And usually be the other way around. This one usually be the one that's not acting right. But good thing this one is the one that's looking a little ugh because that's what my bank can be. <laughs> Y'all, I play all day. And this is how my pencil looks for people who want to know. This is how it looks. It has like the spoolie on the end and then the brush on the other end. So now I'm gonna take, I'm gonna grab some concealer and a brush. So I have this little brush. This is oldie but a goodie. It's by Elf and I think it was like $1 as well. So if you need a concealer brush, mm, this is the one. This is the one. So my skin is getting lighter. Like I feel like it's, it look a little more ashy on camera like my skin, but it's getting lighter because it is starting to get cold outside. So I am actually going to use this concealer, I think. I don't know. One second. Let me go grab another concealer. Yeah. Okay. I'm back and I'm better. I'm back and I'm better. Okay. So here we go. This is the concealer we're going to use. This is also by e.l.f. Y'all, I love to use affordable products because, first of all, I barely know what I'm doing. So, if I barely know what I'm doing, I don't want to spend an arm and a leg on no products. So, I just found some little products that kind of work for me. So, I just put like a, you see my hand? And I know there's people out there that are going to be like, uh, oh, don't do that. And you, you probably shouldn't do it, but but me on the other hand, I do um, just put it on the back of my hand, mix it together, and do what needs to be done. And I'm this high. 
all of that blended out, just take my beauty blender and really just kind of do it like this. And you see how that kind of just blends it all together, but actually before I even do that, I'm gonna take this. And this is just the same color as my eye, just kind of give it a, a nice base. Okay, so there we go. This is our um, eyebrows. So you guys can kind of see how they look up close in person now. Okay, maybe. Y'all, I just want to say that... As a um, YouTuber and stuff, like angles and stuff, trying to get bomb angles is like one of the hardest times because I want my quality and my content to look good, but trying to find the perfect angles is very hard. Okay, y'all, so we're gonna um, rock with this angle. So for my eyes, like I'm not real big on doing too much. So I'm just gonna show y'all a little something that I like to do and keep it real simple so i like to take my contour um and my contour palette and just a little brush any brush because like i said y'all i barely know what i'm doing so i just take this little brush and just brush um brush that into like the crease like that <clears throat> And I'm using these two colors on the end. Yeah, I think that's pretty cute. We're just gonna make sure we blend it out. And another thing, um, I'm sure y'all have seen like the girls like, or like drag it out like that. Like you can do that too, but I just use, I just go back and forth in my crease with the eyeshadow. So we got it together. Yes. She's giving a natural smoky. Natural smoky eye. Is that what he's giving? Y'all let me know. Okay, y'all. So now I'm just gonna take my um liner. Well, actually, before I do that, before I do that, well, actually, yeah, I am gonna do that. So I'm gonna take my liner, which is by Revlon. It's just a liquid liner. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get close, y'all. So I may not be able to do this on camera because I gotta get close to the mirror. Okay, y'all. So I feel like you can definitely see the liner now. It's cute. I just switched over to a different one. This is the Elf liner. Looks like Elf needs to sponsor me because it's giving. I'm sponsored by Elf because I'm using all their products. <laughs> but yeah, I just use this Elf. Let's see what it says. Elf No Budge Retractable Eyeliner. That's what this is, and it turned out cute. Now we're going to work on the face. So for the face, I'm going to be using. Y'all know. Elf. <laughs> this is the poreless face primer and I just use like one or two pumps of it and I just put down where I really want to try the um milk primer because I really I like I like the reviews that it that it has on it and then I just love the way people's makeup look when they use it so I might invest in that. Like, I want people to look at this and be able to recreate it and not have to spend an arm and a leg because I know, y'all, these products are expensive when it comes to just making yourself look like that girl. And let me tell y'all this. Don't think that you need makeup to look like that girl because you already that girl. That girl is something that's within. When I first came up on here, before I had these brows and stuff, I was already that girl. 
You know what I'm saying? So you already that girl before you put that makeup on. This just enhances your beauty. So after I put my primer on, sometimes I do two primers. Um, I have this NYX Professional uh, Pore Filler Primer. I like to use this one sometimes too. And I actually think I am gonna use it. Yeah, so you wanna put this in places that you feel like you have large pores. So after you get that done, now we're moving on to the foundation. So for foundation, y'all, this is my ride or die. This foundation done rolled and died, rolled and died, and rolled and died for me. So I ain't switching up. And if you know anybody who does makeup and does their makeup and stuff, y'all know this is this is a oldie but a goodie. The Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, y'all. Y'all. This right here. And mine is in 334. This right here is the truth. I love it. You can put it like on the back of your hand, on the back of something. I don't recommend you pouring it on your face because am I out? Um, if you pour that on your face, you're gonna always use too much. So I just don't recommend people to do that. Um, I use a brush to uh blend in my foundation. Um, I know some people use a blue beauty blender, but a lot of times I feel like it just takes away from the coverage. So I like to use a brush and I use my fingers to just put it on my face. So like this. And I like it to be thin layers so that I know that I'm not going crazy because I just hate having so much foundation on my face. Like it's just, you we really don't need that much foundation. Um, Normally y'all, I do normally use set and spray, but it looks like I don't even have any right now. So I ran out. So we just gotta work with what we got. Okay, so after blending that out, looks good. So now that we got our foundation on, we're going to conceal, conceal, con con conceal. So I'm going to use my e.l.f., both the same concealers that I use there. We're going to use here. So, just a dot, because this is light. And me personally, I know there are a lot of people who love a super bright under eye, and I don't think I'm one of them. I don't like it super bright. I like it to be like, mm, like brighter, but not too much. So I'm gonna take my beauty blender and I'm just gonna blend all of this out under my eyes. And I'm way too sexy to go on protect you. And she popped a Tesla, now she gonna let you. Okay, alright, that's fine. Okay. Think we got too sexy for that metro house. Diamond popped out on swallow 60. Okay, so as you see, it's brighter, but it's not doing too much. Like it's not over the top. I just don't like a too, I don't like mine too bright. I don't know. I mean, I'm not even saying, cause I'm not a, I'm not a makeup artist. So I can't even speak on what it's really going to do. So you know, nothing like that because I'm not even a makeup artist. I barely know what I'm doing over here, but I'm just showing you guys pretty much what I like to do and what works for me. Yeah, I do like a little. Just a little lightness up there. Oops. Just a little shine. need more things in here. I like it crowded. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I like Okay, so now that I have all of the areas that needed to be concealed, concealed, we're gonna move on to setting powder. So I like to use my black y'all. I just wanna say how it's already getting like snatched up off of the concealer. Like Okay, period. Okay, um, I'm gonna be using the Black Radiance um, 
True Complexion Loose Setting Powder, and this is in the shade Banana. Okay, so just freshly blend this out just to get some of those creases gone and just. Real ass bitch, give a fuck about a nigga. Big broken bag, hold five, six figures. Stripes on my ass, so we call it pussy tigger. Fucking on a scamming ass bitch. So you definitely want to make sure that you. Y'all see that? I swear, like, when I do my makeup, it's like, it's like my mustache pops out even more. We ain't gonna worry about it. Because your girl is still fine. So, I'm gonna take my um, Black Radiant True Complexion Contour Palette, and I'm going to just use these two brown shades to contour. Yep, so how I contour is I contour like all around the perimeters of my face. Um, I contour right here, right here. And then, um, just depending on how I'm feeling, I'll go down my nose too. Okay, so blending out your contour, let me give you all some tips. Um, go in circular motions. And then make sure you drag it into your jawline like that. Yeah, that's a nice contour right there. So next, just kind of clean that up. We're going to take... It's coming together. It's coming together. So next, I have another True Complexion palette. This is the Light to Medium, and I'm going to just use this shade right here to just like blend everything and dust all the rest of this powder off. Just all that types of good stuff. And you lightly, you want to lightly dust. Next, you want to take some blush. I use the same blush. I never use anything else. Um, yeah. So, I'm just going to put that on the apples of my cheeks. Okay, y'all. So, I am using these lashes that I got from the beauty supply store. These are in the name Isabel. Super cute lashes. Well, I never tried these before, but pretty sure they're gonna look cute. Cause I, I I always use this brand, and I'm gonna be using the Duo Lash Glue. I was thinking about using some hair glue because that hair glue don't never, so never fail you. So let me grab my tweezers. You definitely want to use your pair of tweezers, but you can use um regular eyelash glue. You can use hair glue. However you feel. So first things first, what I do with my lashes is I put them on just to kind of see like, okay, do I need to cut anything off? Like, are they too long for my lashes? Stuff like that. I like to check that. They're just a tad, just a teensy weensy bit. So let me go grab some scissors so I can cut off the inside. Okay, got me some scissors. So I'm gonna show you guys if I can, I'm gonna try my best to show you guys what I'm doing. So I take it and I just try to cut off just a little bit, maybe like an inch. I'm gonna just do that much right there. There we go. And that should be good. You're gonna put some glue on here. And the um, eyelash glue that I have, it's a five minute or five second dry, so it doesn't take all day. That's me, I'm just impatient. Because as long as it be taking to dry these eyelashes, I could have done, done my whole face. Like, that's how long it be feeling like it takes, so. All right, let's put this on here. And I use my hands, sometimes I use tweezers, like I just. Now 
Yeah, look at my eyelashes want to do good because I'm on camera. Oop. Okay, so I'm going to come back in and um, like squish them together. I don't know if y'all know anything about that, but I'll show y'all. So we're going to just put the next one on. Okay, so next we're going to take our tweezers and just squeeze the lashes together. This just helps them bond to your um, lashes even more. Like if they weren't already, they are now. The light chuck. So boom. I'm gonna do a lip combo for you guys. Let's see. So I have this um, pencil. This is a lip liner in the shade. Let's see what shade it is in. I don't know. Oh, it's in Palm. And that's the finished look. Let me take this hair down. Let me change shirts because this is giving like the pajama clothes vibes and my face is being in, so we need to be giving vibes. <laughs> so, all right, so, so we're back with a different top on because that one just wasn't given. All right, y'all, so this is the finished makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you guys follow my tutorial on doing your makeup because I really actually had fun doing this. I haven't done a tutorial in so long on like makeup. So hope you guys like this. Comment down below and let me know. And make sure you like the video. Make sure you give me a thumbs up if you enjoy watching this, vibing with me, all of that good stuff. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.